Hey there guys and welcome to the next part of Catherine Remastered. I don't know if this is the finale. Seems like it. Unless they added something new, I don't know. Uh, let's continue. How tall is this damn thing? I've been climbing forever. Really? You're almost there. Now sit down. Entertaining to witness someone becoming a legend doesn't happen often. Not that it would matter to you. What makes you so desperate? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to rescue the person who's most important to me. Hmm. Now let me ask. What are you living for? Just who are you? What do you mean? Uh -huh. That's the curse. There's no escaping this place without having an answer of some sort. But I must say, I didn't expect this. You've definitely changed my view of a world I thought I knew. You're truly fascinating. Now let me ask you one final question. This is the 18th question. Do you have the resolve to do what it takes for the one you love? <laughs> That's your answer. I understand. There was once a man who took up this challenge, just like you. This man became a legend. He stopped being human and became one of us. <laughs> yes, he is Thomas Mutton, the one awaiting you at the next trial. Now that he has become one of us, we call him Dumuzid. All the traps were created by him. He knows this place through and through, making him a difficult opponent. So he used to be a human. Well, I'm not gonna lose to him. You will now be faced with the creator of the Great Trials. Use all the techniques you've learned to avoid his fierce attacks. The time has come. <laughs> Starting to lose your nerve? think you'd actually make it here. That was a marvel to watch. Well, it seems the others were altogether too easy on you. So for tonight's extravaganza, I shall deal with you personally. Whatever. Rin better not be hurt. There's no need to concern yourself with such things. After all, tonight, You'll be dining on my mutton special. It's a pity. But I'm going to need you to die for me. Shut up! Let's get this over with already. I'm bringing Rin home no matter what. Hang on. Thomas Mutton has appeared. It's the killer. Do not die. Edge. I got it. Edge. 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 Edge.
You don't have any time. Head goes boom. isn't going to keep throwing these at me forever until I die, is he? Don't worry, there will be an end to this. A pinnacle. The next stage will be your last, I assure you. So come, sit down. <sighs> You're finally here. Above this place is a path that reaches to the heavens. I knew you were different from the other lambs, but I didn't expect you to show this much potential. Why are you so impressed? Aren't you trying to kill us? Killing indecisive men is only one of our goals. If any of them show potential, we try their souls and offer them freedom. Don't forget, this nightmare opened a new path for you, did it not? My job here is done. You've successfully endured the baptism. Coming next will be the final trial of the heavens. This will be your last battle. I am always near you. I have many faces and many names. When this sanctuary is bathed in Ishtar's love, I'll see you again, in a place far removed from here. Somewhere else? Keep your eyes up, and go! Hey, you have to tell me twice. You sure love to talk, right up to the end.
The final stage of the great trials is upon us. This is the ultimate test. Face the gods' full power with all your might. When you reach heaven's door, you will gain true freedom. How long is this gonna go on? games here. I'm almost there. Who's gonna win tonight, bitch? What are you talking about? I was just messing around. Just making you come.
Are you okay? Vincent, you're not hurt, are you? I'm fine. I'm gonna get you out of there right now. <clears throat> Ren, I missed you. I missed you too. I can finally tell you what's been on my mind. Ren, I love you. But you already have a... I broke up with her. And I'm... I'm a boy, so... I don't care. That doesn't matter to me. Not anymore. What matters is who you are. And that's something I don't want to let go of. Vincent... To tell you the truth, my memories came back that day. But I was too shocked by the rejection. The more I told myself not to love you... The more painful it got. So I ran away. I'm sorry. Just look who you're talking to. I'm practically the master of running away. But through it all, you actually accepted me for who I am. When I thought about that, I started to see a new future, totally different from the way I live now. It's simple, isn't it? Nothing matters more than what's in your heart. That's how I'll live my life from now on. What do you think? Vincent, I feel the same way. I want to spend my life with you. Sorry to break it to you, but I won. I'm bringing Ren back home. <laughs> No, you'll never beat me, you bastard! And click the PDA! What? Are you stupid? I already did beat you! Shut up! You cannot deny the natural order of things. My noble cause could never be thwarted by your twisted desires. Oh, come on! Is that still what you think? There is so much more to love than what assholes like you consider normal. I mean, I can't claim to be the greatest guy in the world or anything, but I am human, and I won't be told how to live by someone like you! If you really care about the human race, then I urge you to think of another way. I'll help you myself if you're willing to seek it. <clears throat> you're just being selfish. All right, Mutton. What I want isn't really the point. People's lives aren't planned out for them. There's no road map. Look for another path, one that doesn't involve controlling people. When you find that, your world will expand like never before. Right, Ren? Yes. Life is full of possibilities. All right, I'm done with this guy. Ren. I love you. I love you too. Stop it!
Congratulations! That was some impressive climbing. I can't believe you really reached heaven. The power of love certainly is something. Vincent Brooks, you win. It's nice to be able to see you again. How'd you enjoy the show? A perfect escape from the terrifying nightmare. You led Vincent out with your exceptional skills. Even Astaroth, the mastermind behind the nightmares, was amazed. Did you hear what Vincent said? People are free to choose how they live. That conviction was so strong that not even a god could put a stop to it. <laughs> oh, they're so cute it makes your skin crawl. <laughs> With love this strong, they'll be able to face anything. Coming up, we have an update from Vincent at the uh, usual haunt. Well, you may know by now that things are not always as they seem. Looks like there's more to this story. <laughs> Let's take a peek, shall we? So it all worked out, huh? Yeah! You'd better not cause any more tears. I know, I know. Ben, I promise you, I'll never hurt you like that, ever again. From now on, I'll support you, no matter what happens. Vincent... I love you so much! Ren. Okay, that's enough, you little lovebirds. <laughs> I'm happy for you, too. So, what's the plan now? Think you'll keep playing piano for us? What? Is that really an option? You got a problem with that? Please have mercy. I can't let an angel stay here. Have you no fear in your bones? <laughs> an angel, huh? Sounds about right. It's true. I came here to fulfill my duties, but I finished. The nightmares are over. I'm sure my brother will let me become human now. Mm -hmm. Wait, become human? We are exalted creators who have led your kind since ancient times, beings with the power of gods. Huh? Young one, do you stand by the words you've spoken? Brother? That's your... Uh, your brother? Hey, is that really your brother? Yeah. In this world, people refer to us as angels. Angels? Like, like literally? Absolutely unacceptable! Here are both your fact! Explain yourself! We approved your socialization with humans for the sake of the mission. But giving your heart to such a creator, and even wishing to become one yourself, we shall never allow it! We have no choice but to erase your memories again, take you back home, and re-educate you. Uh, question! 
You're saying that's it? Rin's going home? I refuse. I'm staying here. Vincent and I, we're in love. In love? Sorry, but you're kind of losing me here. <laughs> Mere moments from now, meteors shall come crashing down upon you. Not a shred of humanity will remain. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Please stop it. If you saw the strength of his will for yourself, even you would understand. Humankind is precious. They're full of potential. Isn't that right, Vincent? Uh, me? Uh... If you insist, we shall offer this human a trial before the end. Prove your worth to us. Show us this will, if you so wish for us to rethink our decision. Right. But wait, uh, what, a, a trial? <sighs> of course it's something like this. Accept our challenge. We won't slack off like someone you know. <laughs> Save me! I don't really get what you're saying. But if refusing means you'll take Rin away, then my only option is to accept. If I win, you go back home alone. And while you're at it, you take the meteors back with you too. We look forward to killing you. Now then, we shall grant you a moment's respite. We suggest you make your final farewells. Got a mail. Erica did my makeup the other day. What are you getting yourself into? She said it looked really good on me. It was kind of fun, you know? What do I even say to that? Nora. I'm just saying, maybe it's not that bad. You guys have been so adventurous lately. It's so cool. I'm too chicken to do that stuff. You're pretty out there already, man. You got a mail. How much did I drink? I must be seeing things. Uh, I don't think it's the alcohol. Well, at this point, nothing would surprise me. I'm kind of surprised you guys are cool with all this. Well, I've reconsidered a few things in my life thanks to you. It's time to stop waiting around for my soulmate to show up at my doorstep. Whoa, Chief. Do you mean... I'm going to go out and search myself. That should be interesting. Quite a commotion going on outside. Everyone's talking about miracles and God's messenger. Oh, he could have been a little more subtle about this. Ah, oh, man, I drank way too much. Thought I saw an angel descending from the heavens. You know that was actually Rin's 
Uh, don't lecture me. I'm having a hard enough time keeping up as it is. Just make sure you love birds reach that happy ending. Angels, demons, who cares? If they get in your way, just kick their asses. <laughs> I'm lucky to have you guys. Man, the world's crazier than I thought. Right when you think you know everything, something else comes along to flip it all on its head. You got a mail. To Lynn. Would you like to speak to Mark? I have something wonderful to tell you. We are going to be on the news. Why? What did you guys do? We didn't do anything. We just predict the future. We predict sports, politics, the economy, and the stock market every day. Yeah, that's pretty TV worthy. We were approached by a TV producer while we were telling fortunes out in the city. The name of the segment has already been decided. Martha and Lindsay's life forecast. It'd be nice to have a theme song. Perhaps it was you who led us on this new path. Thank you, man of legends. The legends just gonna have to carry on a little longer. Maybe we should practice singing too. Maybe we should practice dancing too. What are you two trying to do? If you want an autograph, now's your chance. It's time for us to say goodbye. Good night. See you tomorrow. I'm paying the price for sleeping around. We're actually thinking about starting our own company. I want to open up a restaurant. A real fancy one. What about a donut shop with like a pompadour logo? A, a donut shop? What? Why is that? It's a perfect representation of how we ended up here. Because we sure as hell dug ourselves this hole. <sighs> I don't understand. Oh, ho, ho. hey, Archie, was that? Uh, just forget I said anything. Keep living my life too. It's all thanks to you. I heard Boss is returning to his hometown. Well, I couldn't just let the place shut down, so I offered to run it myself. You? This is a resting place for anxious minds. I had to hold on to it. Well, this place ain't exactly the talk of the town. Hope you can keep it afloat. I decided to get back into reporting as well, although I'm still afraid to write. I guess running the bar will be like a hobby. It should keep me busy for a while. I guess I'll have to start calling you boss. You're an especially valuable customer, so please drop by any time. Although, you're gonna have to pay your time. It's the unadulterated truth. You got a mail. Your tab is just keep it open. What's 
have a toast. surprises what happened that purse snatcher I arrested the other day turned out to be the guy who shot my wife what <laughs> I never thought I'd catch him so easily no matter how bad things seem life has a way of offering a solution as long as you're alive you taught me that I got what I wanted now I have no regrets quitting the force what are you gonna do after you quit go pro what I always wanted to take my tennis hobby to a professional level I'm going to pursue that dream, because it's never too late. That's my new outlook on life. I've even developed a new technique. It utilizes the elasticity of my belly. I call it the barrel belly break shot. I'm going to practice it. Care to join? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, shoot, this is tough. I never would have imagined meeting an angel. Doesn't matter. I've gotta do it. Be there soon enough. Just be patient. Hey, Vincent! Something incredible happened. Uh, calm down. What, what, what's going on? I helped this lady who had collapsed on the street. And... She just so happened to be the chairwoman of my company. My fiancé was there, too. I guess she thought the chairman was a regular old lady didn't lift a finger for her. That really showed her true colors. My parents heard that and reconsidered the arranged marriage. And now they approve of me being with Daniel. That's great news. Congratulations. The chairwoman told me something interesting. She said a person's heritage and social standing no longer dictates their path in life, and that people are capable of becoming whatever they want to be. The world looks a little more open to me now. Thank you, Vincent. I'm not gonna let him wipe out humanity like it's nothing. Good luck with your relationship, Vincent. Hmm? Are you dating someone? You didn't know? <laughs> You're so clueless. There! Sorry about my brothers. It's fine, really. To meet your family sooner or later. So, your name's not actually Catherine, is it? Where did that come from? Then? I guess I just blurted out the first name I remembered after I lost my memory. I was told to watch out for Catherine the Succubus. So, that's what happened. By the way, my real name is Hirabo Nurtha. Uh -huh. Can I just keep calling you Rin? <laughs> are pretty serious. I've never seen them so angry before. I don't really get what's going on, but I'm the man of legends. I can save the world. I hope. <laughs> I believe in you, Vincent. You can do it. Man, the bank balance is grim. What? Love conquers all, right? It has to. struggle, the more passionately love grows. If you guys work together, you can overcome anything in your way. Are you speaking from experience? I'm still trying to overcome my own obstacles. 
That's why I'm excited to see what the future has in store for you two. By the way, I'm thinking of taking the test soon. For your driver's license. I'm not sure the world's ready to let you loose on the road. No, you dummy. I'm talking about the qualifier for women's wrestling. Um, what? Seriously? You'll win a lot of money if you bet on me. I'm a little nervous taking the test by myself, though. I wonder if I can find a good partner somewhere. Don't look at me. reports of unidentified flying objects across the world. Some experts believe this is the work of angels said to take place every few hundred years. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Wait, are, are we still on? Uh, I apologize. I'll continue with the news. Uh, she is totally losing it. That was an angel whose infamy reaches the very depths of hell. Oh, right. Of course. To anger a being like that. Now I'm done. I'm going home. Don't try to stop me. Oh, man, get over it. back again soon. Can I get a drink? Understood. Here you go. Uh, 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 Rin, I didn't order wine. It looks really expensive. The full-bodied stuff. I know this is sudden, but here is some trivia about wine for those who are enjoying Catherine full body. Unlike white wine, red wine isn't categorized as sweet or dry. To express the richness of a red wine, it is described by likening it to the shape of a woman's body. Light, medium, and full. Hmm. I wonder what a full body looks like. And that was the trivia for tonight. Please enjoy a variety of alcoholic drinks and learn more trivia facts. Rin, that wine is for another customer. Oh? Sorry, I made a mistake. Oh, don't worry about it. But please let me know if there's anything else you'd like to order. Stay as long as you'd like. Uh, wine. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. I'll bring it right over. Here you go. Brother was not exactly what I expected. Damn, I can't even taste this. Drink. Gotta calm my nerves. Oof. Empty. What would you like? Take a beer. Beer. I'll bring it right over. Here you go.
I was not expecting there to be more. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time.